guys welcome back to my ch channel Ebubedike is receiving wotu wotu yes he is receiving wotu wotu i took a trip to his instagram handle and what did i see there what i saw there made me weep for this great man the comments i read there made me weep for this great man kai you know how it is said that an elder does not stay at home and watch the she goat deliver in its tetas an elder is supposed to be an elder and people have been talking this one wrote you failed me your daughter and those kids you did movie and frolic around with a woman who wreaked havoc in your grandchildren's life may suffer than you did nothing but add fuel to fire where was your wisdom this other person wrote it has finally happened issue you and your family would have resolved once and for all your son has finally exposed his family to polygamy public and danger it is well sending love and light to queen may and then this person wrote how on earth can a man support his son to bring in another man's wife secondly the judeostim boldly sells charm padlocks and other satanic sorcerers sorceries on her page god cannot stay in such a family why are you and judy destroying you's home guys you know the, i can go on and on and on people keep writing negative things condemnatory uh statements against um uh, chief pete Doce. they said he could not save his family from this embarrassment that what is happening now he has a hand in it this person wrote favor dora wrote pet pet once an icon now history will not remember you kindly a spot will forever be and then edogo wrote your attitude towards the whole second marriage issue acting with a strange woman which i could have bet on my life you can never do the death of your grandchild and your comment on an interview about his death is still sickening to me i've always been wondering who you really are behind closed doors and the kind of trauma your wife must have gone through living with you it's obvious you have no regard for female gender it really speaks volume about your personality i pray you really um deep you really deeply reflect and make amends where need be we can go on and on and on people condemned him condemned his utterances uh in the uh interview he granted after his grandson's death they said he had no business mentioning that those who are good die early guys well in the midst of all these things there are people who believe that you ledoche brought the ant infested uh, fagots to himself and he should bear the consequences alone i will read to you one long miss uh, episode from ab sweden she wrote at you ledoche was dancing surugede at you ledoche danced the dance of death but he didn't realize that it was a death song he thought it was a jubilation song it was not because he married a second wife Mba no he was within he was within his right it was only because of the way he went about it we Igbos have omena and a culture the first wife accompanies the husband to go and take a second wife in Igbo land you married his second wife had a son seized the children of judy's real husband obase and denied him access and visitation to them you shared the news of the marriage after an online blogger a gist lover media gram informed hmm. the world that wasn't our culture a bedike you yourself know sir that at you ledoche your son failed in that regard and he failed alone because you had trained him the best way any parent could i do not support those calling you out sometimes you have you have to let a child choose his path so that if the fire burns his hand he will learn never to put hand in the fire again i leave you sir and all the great members of the nigerian online readers association and the members of online in-laws consent group with these words of chino achebe do not despair 
I know you will not despair. You have a manly and a proud heart. A proud heart can survive a general failure because such a failure does not prick its pride. It is more difficult and more bitter when a man fails alone. You fail alone. May may at may you le doche be comforted or zemena. Guys, these are deep words. Okay, let me read this one too. I hate nonsense. One, two, three roots. Sa. I want to let you know that your son at Yule Doche is under a spell. He needs deliverance urgently. And Judy Austin used jazz on him. Is her adulterous best bestie Sarah that sold it uh, to her. She used it on your prodigal son at Yule Doche and it works on him. That is why she's helping her to advertise on her page. The one that is working on your son now is the control package. Guys hey all right and the final one i'm going to read just be patient with me mebel chimso wrote at pete doche what sort of stupid analysis is this that talented bright and unusual that talented bright and unusual kids don't last long instead of you to reflect on your actions towards at me you le doche and her children you're rather trying to blame who destiny nature your son and you le doche's ego pride and actions with your help and support has caused this calamity did you consider the mental and emotional health of your grandchildren before you accepted that product of adultery grandchild into your family did you you probably acted in a movie produced by Judy. What for? Why your daughter-in-law May is not happy with the situation? Snake of Africa. Hey, hey guys, I I'm, I'm tired. I cannot read any longer. People did not fail to register, you know, their displeasure over uh, the role played by uh, Chief Pete Doche. I do not know what to think. Guys, what do you think? Do you think that people are right to condemn him? You know, because they felt he supported his son. First, they justified it. They said, first, he did not condemn it. Second, he came in the open and, and talked about uh, Solomon, uh, have equated his son with Solomon. And thirdly, he acted in a movie produced by Judy. He accepted Judy's son you know without discrimination without having regard for me and his her children i do not know what to think anymore but this one is in your court please leave your comment at the comment section let's rob minds are people right or is he right and then thirdly before i forget this last one that i wrote they said he granted an interview and in that interview he blamed destiny he said it is natural for that child who was bright to have died. I don't even know what to think anymore. May the soul of Kambi rest in peace. And of course, I condole, you know, with the family of the Edochia. Hmm. This is a trying time for them. Let us all remember them in our prayers. Peace. See you in my next video. Bye.